overseas. At home, it is no big deal as most of us have the unlimited plans or at least a program that throttles down to turtle speed after 20 or so gigabyte. But not the case at all when you're strolling through Europe. With your network provider, that's, that's when those scary overages kick in with you coming back to a big and unexpected phone bill. Even with a pocket Wi-Fi from the folks over at the wireless traveler, you can end up with an auto recharge on a device the whole family is sharing. So how do you deal with that? The folks at the wireless traveler advise us to remember to turn off your pocket Wi-Fi device at the end of each data session so you don't end up inadvertently using more data than you want to. Put your phone on airplane mode if you are finished using your carrier plan for data. Also, disable all automatic email updates, auto-syncing, or even push notifications you may have set up. This includes iOS updates to new versions on iPhones. Leave the activity until you return home, or better yet, do it before you leave for your trip. Also, the attachments and videos that come with some emails can chew up bundles of data, so be sure to turn off the setting to automatically upload attachments to your emails. I mean, think of all the spam we get. Who needs that eating up your data plans when you're traveling? If you do get a set of video clip, resist the urge to click it while using your carrier data plan on your or your wireless traveler pocket Wi-Fi, as you'd be surprised how much data even a short video clip of 30 seconds can use. Same with scrolling Instagram. Most importantly, turn off your data in your phone or turn off your pocket Wi-Fi device when you finish your data sessions and leave all the data intense activity for the Wi-Fi back at your hotel. Using free Wi-Fi for video and email browsing, as long as there are no personal secure information being viewed, will be just fine and preserve your data for when you are out and about with no bill shock when you get home. We hope you enjoyed listening this week and we look forward to meeting up again next Thursday for more tech tips from our friends over at the Wireless Traveler. If you would like to get in contact, call them at 1-866-700-3883 or wirelesstraveler.com. And remember, if you purchase, put in the code PEAKS, P-E-E-K-S, and get 15% off. Thank you, Wireless Traveler. That was fantastic information, super information, because you don't really think about it. You know, we're so used to just clicking and looking at Facebook and that stuff and loading whatever videos somebody may have posted. I do it all the time. I don't even really think about it. But this was really good information, guys. I hope you will take take heed about what's going on with your data usage when you're traveling abroad. Well, it has come to that time of the show where we're done. We're, we've run out of time again. Remember, I need to know what days you guys like to hear this show. I'd like to hear from you. I see I'm getting a lot of play. Lots of people listening, downloading, and all, you know, I love it. Thank you so much. I'm so thankful, so grateful, and I'm going to do better. I feel better. I'm healthy now, so the show is going to get rolling. We've got Uh, John Wolf that's going to be talking about the music festival. I've got Dion Ross who's putting together a fantastic um, this woman is dynamic. She she is in the uh, the TV industry in Austin, Texas and she's got an organization now that she calls Women on the Rise women supporting each other and, um, and she's a handbag designer and she's a podcaster herself and she's living her best life and doing her bucket list and checking it off and she's going to be putting a cruise together for some ladies and we're going to have her on the show. We're going to talk about sports tourism again. We're going to talk about what's going on there. We're going to get back to our cannabis tourism because everybody seems to like the cannabis tourism Um shows that we've been doing so we're going to do that and we're of course going to talk about holiday travel that's coming up if you have not made your holiday travel plans now is the time to do so it is important if you want some really good deals of course we've got travel plans for 2020 now's the time put those groups together we've got groups all the way through 2021 that we're putting together right now 
If you are someone that is influential, that has a is a part of a group or organization, or you thought about taking your show on the road, contact us and let me tell you how you can travel and do a conference or do your event while you're traveling. It's really simple, folks. It's really, really simple. And we'll talk about being a group leader, what that means. There's just so many topics in the travel industry that we can talk about. This show will go on for the rest of my life, and I don't have a problem with it. But I'm glad you listened to us this week. I have enjoyed talking to you today, and I hope you have a, a fabulous week. I hope you have a fabulous weekend, and the weather stays beautiful so that you get to do what you want to do outside. And um, let us know if we can help you with travel plans. This is Karen Duncan, your bucket list buster. And I am looking forward to spending more time with you in the upcoming, upcoming weeks. This is your bucket list buster. Travel recharges your mind, body, and soul, and you deserve it. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss an episode. We're here to help you start living your dreams, guys. Visit me on Facebook and Instagram. Thanks for joining me. I hope you found some resources in today's show that excite your travel juices, provide you some valuable information on your next trip, and it gave you permission to take time off and have some fun someplace in the world. See you next week. Ciao.